Hello tubers, it's your crazy British bloke here. Well, you know I do a lot of work around the condo corp. Well I got a phone call, someone's got a busted toilet. So anyway, I came around a little bit earlier and had a look at it. And what it is, it's the valve where all the water comes in. Um, and sometimes you can clean them out, but this one's actually knackered. So I went down and I got myself a new one of these, a fill valve. And uh, they're pretty easy to put in, so I thought I might show you how you do it. I don't know, maybe you'll like it, maybe you won't. Um, so anyhow, uh, let's get started. Right, here's the old toilet, nasty little toilet. So we shut that one down. Uh, we'll take this lid off it. You can see what we've got to do. Oh, that's heavy. Right. right. See, there's all the silt and stuff that comes in muck and rusty shit out of the pipes and it gets in to the fill valve there and sometimes you can take this you can take this top off and you can flush it out that's what I tried to do but this one the it's old and the rings are gone so we've got to replace this little bugger here so first thing is to get rid of the water now what's happening with this one is it dribbles in very slowly it takes I don't know 10 minutes or more for that thing to fill up so Get rid of the water first, in here, as much as come out as will. Now you'll see, it's just dribbling, yeah? It's hardly filling up. So what we need to do is turn off this here, tap, get that off, and I need to get the water out of there. I've got myself a handy dandy sponge and then we're going to take this out and put the new one in so okay, I'll put you on a tripod and get that done right let's see using the old sponge dirty old sponge you've got there I've taken all the excess water out of there that was left in there and uh, thrown it into the toilet here the water's turned off now what we've got to do is we have to undo this there's a little hose thing here look on the top that goes in the overflow hose. Now, underneath here, we can undo, you can't quite see it, I'll show you in a minute. You can undo this, should undo. No, that's tight. Come on. You undo the hose that goes to the bottom of it. I haven't brought a wrench in with me, have I? Does it need one? No, it doesn't. No, I thought so. It's got the plastic on it with the big knobs on the side so I can undo it. Right, so we undo this one. Hopefully there's no water in there. No, so that's now undone. Now there's another one, the top one that goes to this. And you undo that. Pretty easy. Long thread on it. Where are you? Right, and then we pull that out. Now, did it bring the valve with it? The rubber. Yeah. And that brought the rubber with it, right? So now it's out. And what you do is you get your new one out of the packet here. Okay. And we want to get it the same length as the other one. I don't know if you can see that. Got to get that same length as the other one. So what we do is we undo it here. It makes a snapping noise when it comes down. Go all the way down and get it the same length. And that is nearly the same length. What's that like? Let's have a look. Uh, I'd say that's about it. Right, now in the box should have a new one of these 
you see that? Comes with all its bits. I don't need that lot. I can pop this out of here. It's got like another one in the middle of it. Come on. Pop that out. Don't need that bit. Now which uh, was that? It's that way up. So we put that on the end of that one. Like so. It's a bit awkward in these places at all. It's not that big. Alright, that's that. Now, put that back through the hole. Find the thing. Right. And we get our new one of these, see? Don't need a wrench. See, it's got the bits on the side of it. Screw that back on the bottom. And because it's rubber, it will seal really well. No leaks are good. that one on. Now we put this one back on. Do that one up underneath there. That's nice and tight. Now, <coughs> see on this old one it's got like a hose. Oh, somewhere in this box is a new one. There it is. New hose and there should be another bit. Where's that bit gone? There it is. Another piece there. The hose goes onto that like so. goes in here, I'll show you in a minute, when it clips in here, find out how to clip it in, come on where are you, that clips in there, and that way around, hang on, it's going to get in the hole, that clips in there like that, that goes onto this, one here, like so, put that in there, that's it, now we should be able to turn the water back on, so let's see, oh yeah, now that's running perfect, now I might have to adjust it, I don't know. So I'll uh, I'll take you off of here now and I'll show you what I did. Right, it's all back together, no leaks. Uh, they, they've got big rubbers and all in there now, it doesn't leak anymore, you just do it hand tight, just over hand tight. So let me show you. There it is. There's the new one in there. There's the old one. Um, the water was set a little bit too high in that before, so I've set it down a bit. It should be just below that that thing there. Seems to work great. Let's give it a flush. It's a big old toilet, really. It should have one of them low flush ones in it nowadays, but that's what it's got. Works great. That shuts off good, and she's uh, she's coming up nice. So, there you go, another little job, a quick little job, um, makes a hundred bucks quite easily on a little job like this, so uh, anyhow, if you want to know how to fix your toilet, if it's playing you up, that's how you do it with one of those, so 
Anyhow, talk to you later.